Hey, it's Ben here, and this is an answer to a question I got on my recent tutorial on how to animate lines in Final Cut Pro 10, where I show how to kind of grow lines and create some pretty cool animations using them. This question really asked how you could grow a line in one direction, so how you can grow it all the way from the left out to the right, or vice versa. Um, and there's a couple of neat little tricks that you can do when you're setting this up. So we're going to jump into our generators at the top left here and scroll down to our generators and our solids and we're looking for the, the custom solid here. Now you can use any of these other ones but we're just going to use the custom because it allows you to select your own custom color. We'll jump up to the inspector where we'll change the color. We'll just grab this orange and then we're going to come into the video options here and we're going to transform it. So basically we're going to transform the Y scale so that this becomes a line. All right. And then the key here is in order to grow it, so at the moment if we scale this line it's going to grow from the middle out. The key to make it growing from the left is to change the anchor point. So this is where it's useful to know the resolution of your video edit. So here we're working with a 1920 by 1080 pixel edit um, and basically we're going to halve that number and change the anchor point. So we're going to change the X anchor point to minus 960 and that is going to make this anchor point all the way to the left of that line. And then I'm going to change the X position as well to minus 960. Okay, so now what you'll see here, and we'll just come forward in time a bit, and now if we change the X value of this line, it's going to scale to this left-hand side, which is essentially where we've moved that anchor point to. So if we turn on our transform options here, you can see that anchor point is all the way to the left. And it's just easy to do this numerically, a little bit of math, half the width of what you have uh, to kind of get this to work right. So now, um, once that's set up, I am going to come ahead in time. I'm going to set a keyframe for my X scale. I'll come back a few seconds and then we'll scale this all the way down. And now you'll see when it plays on, we'll get that line growing out from the left. So if we want to speed this up or slow it down, we can right click on here and come to show video animation. And then if we zoom in a little bit, you can see we can speed this up by moving those close together, or we can slow them down by moving them further apart, these two transform keyframes. Okay, so basically we've got our line uh, set up there. We could obviously grow this from the right, or now that we have it growing, let's just duplicate this. We can really move this as we want to. So I can move this to here. We'll just taper these a little bit. So now I get one line starting there and then another line growing on as well. And so we can move these around. We could even rotate them. So I could have lines growing at different angles. that is how to set up your line so it will grow from one direction and then we just need to position this so that it's actually in the spot we want it to grow from so we could position that anchor point all the way across to the right and now that line will grow out from the right to the left so really simple um, just a question of moving the anchor point and then also moving the original position so that you can grow it out from the left. And then you have a line you can animate and position in any way you want to in Final Cut Pro 10. Hope that's useful. If you have any questions about animating on lines, animating on circles, I've created a couple of tutorials recently. I'll leave the links in the description below. And I look forward to seeing you on the next tutorial.